So please welcome Liz and James from Department of Conservation and of course Jeremy from Willowbank. So good morning guys. Good morning. Thank you for coming in. No now this week kicks off Conservation Week, right? As yep. of today. What is it all about this year? It's all about showing New Zealand you love it. Yeah. yeah. I mean just really encouraging people to get out there, realise what a beautiful country this is, some of the amazing wildlife it contains and really enjoying it. So true and of course as well as loving the country we love all the creatures in it. Who are these guys? Tell us about what you've brought in. So we've got two Otago skinks. They are the biggest skinks that we have in New Zealand. They grow up to 30 centimetres long. Whoa, and they are quite big, eh? Yeah, yeah, and they're really endangered. There's only a few thousand of them left in the world. So what can we do to protect them? Um, well, predators are the, are the big bad guys for the, um, for the skinks. So. Yeah. They eat them, unfortunately. So, so we, is that things like possums or um, what are things, those? Mainly stoats, stoats, cats, things like that, ferrets. Mm. Yeah. Yep. So it's just managing the predators and that will... Yeah. Yep. We've got to look after their habitat as well, make sure that you know those beautiful wild places are kept pristine and well looked after. Yeah, but yeah, really it's unfortunately about removing the nasties. Yeah. Removing the nasties, you heard them. <laughs> and of course you've got lots of um, endangered animals at Willowbank, right Jeremy? We do, yep. Could yep. you tell us about this guy? It's very sure. exciting. That's a tuatara. A tuatara are pretty special because they're actually a living dinosaur. So they've been around as long, well, when dinosaurs were around. Man. Pretty incredible. This Fire. guy's just, just a baby, probably about 11 years old. Just a baby? Yeah, well they'll live over 100. Man, and so of course they've been around for 200 million years since the dinosaurs. Pretty Why much. do you think they've survived so long? I heard about something about them having like a low blood pressure or a low heartbeat or something. Is well, that true? Well, they can slow right down, yeah. But it's probably more to do with size. They're a lot smaller than the, you know, the big dinosaurs. Yeah. There's lots of different theories, but that's probably one of the more more credible ones. Wow, interesting. All right. Wow, oh, hey, Ronnie. look amazing, They're right? so cool. Found this little guy wandering around in the back of He is Aren't so cute. Now, is, would, would a ferret be a pest for these guys? Yeah, definitely. definitely. Yeah. I'm going to say he's cute, though. It's he's the, really adorable. It's a legend, though, but if, if you kiss it, they'll actually, you know, change into something awesome. Jim, <laughs> like a prince? I dare you to kiss him. <laughs> You're joking. <laughs> No, I'm not turkey. I dare you to kiss him. <laughs> is that okay with you, Jerry? <laughs> not mine. I'm the... <laughs> okay, where? Ready? Right down. Just right down. Oh, brilliant! That is oh. <laughs> the audience is going, oh great. She didn't change at all. Yeah, I don't see no prints around here, Ronnie. Well, <laughs> we run home, that's how you kiss a ferret. There you go. And thank you so much for bringing in the skinks this morning and the Tuatara, no Jeremy. Problem. And for you at home, head to whatnow.tv for a link to the doc website where you can learn how to do your bit.